deadly for move. I don't know. Hey, welcome back! Um, trying to sound thing again. And, ooh, might be a bit too quiet this time. But, I'll figure out the right stuff to do. Sorry if there was any screeching, horrible noises in your ear. But we will um, try to avoid such crosses and press forward to stop making noises. Just running. I like running. Why were you looking this way? Alexander, is it inside the castle? Flash in a manner of speaking, come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... What did you call it? The inner sanctum, my most precious chamber, Daniel, and it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenberg. That's... I really don't care that much for what you were saying, Mr. Alexander, but I'm disturbed. Paprika, quiet, that sounds like lead. Who uses lead? Anything down here? No. Probably was. I uh, was too. What's up here? Oh my god! Fuck off. Apparently wants me to go. Going that way. We're going to the laboratory. Ah, <laughs> laboratory. I will scream. There's no denying this. I might cry. It's okay. You don't see me crying. This is fine. We're fine. It's good. It's all good in the neighborhood. No, it's not a lie. Song. Pretend that you're not scared, cause why would you be scared? Why would you be scared? Cause you have your oil. So we're going this way. We're going this way, not that way. This way. Something is wrong. Oh, so wrong. No, nothing's wrong. Okay, so, um, torch. There. Yeah. yeah. Got a torch. They call him. Ah, oh. uh, hello. Hello. Water things. Fuck you. Oh my god, we have so much water. Got some cool things. Chimney views. I'm not going to use that. I'll probably need to later, but not now. Should be more Kuprite. Right? Let me see, let me see. And one part aqua force. I'm just clicking stuff, man. I don't know what that means. You can pause and read that. I probably interrupted this cutscene so many times. It's like, fuck you. Art. Ooh. Clever, clever. Take it back in there. I'll get you in a minute. Let me just get the thing. Can I crouch? Ah, uh, yes, I can. This could be a bad scene if I can get to. Okay, we're fuck we're in the light, so calm. There you go. Wow, it's okay. So cool. This is very cool. Am I missing anything? I probably am.
searching for them down here? I think, I think it said it was all in the wine cellar. Do you need do you need calm? Okay, yeah, yeah. Let's just look for a, a key thing. A key thing. That's fine. Find the puzzle thing. Dollars. Just exploring, doing just, just just going around, doing shit, figuring out where to go. This looks nice. I was gonna say this looks really nice. I'd be lying. Oh wait. 16th of May, 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. All right, so we're digging. We're looking for things, and so uh, we found. Oh. Get to the shop, perhaps. We'll get to why we're here and why we have to kill this. This man. What is this? Get away from me! I don't know where you are. I don't want you. Okay, this room is pretty dark. Security. Yeah, don't want to have to worry about so much. No. Oh my god, these chairs need to, we need to fix that. And, oh, yeah, there we go. A letter! There's a light right there. I don't like this music that's playing. I don't want it. I don't like anything that's going on here. But I think that's the point, right? The point is for me to be uncomfortable. They are doing a good job. I tip my hat to you as I. May 1839. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. 
Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Oh no! Well, don't trust rocks. Lesson for today. Two rocks are not good for trusting. Okay, let's see. No, I don't see anything. Uh, did we go in here already? No, we did not. I wasn't in the such a fucking plan. Don't make sounds. Don't make sounds. Why is there a fucking tomato plan? Try and conserve probably to a stupid extent. Just because I don't like you. What the fuck? I think I'm getting closer. What? Of course. Blood. Of course, dripping blood. What else would that be? Shut up. Play creepy music and creep someone out around the corner. I like throwing things. That's fine. What is this? Throw, that's what it is. Uh, I already did that once. Okay, light. Whoa! Whoa! What was that? Right. I think we're getting somewhere, guys. If we um, have cave in, can't go back. We surely must be somewhere. Why are you freaky? Stop! Stop! The 17th of May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized. It was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. This is not good. This just can't be good. Oh. I control. I don't want to get it. Must pretty. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. That's cool. Though. Just, yeah, sorry. I reached out, pretty. closing it in my hands. I want the, the faint pretty. glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away. Precious! Spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted. The voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety. And grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. That, that, that. 
that's probably very old. This is a nice one. I like it. What's going on? Much of the castle oh, is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working on it. Alrighty, so things have happened and we've seen glowy things and we've heard pianos so i'm gonna end it here and see you next time bye, -bye.